What's up, guys? This is Dota Tavern bringing you another episode of. Oh, okay. Well, so Valve has released a Dota Pro Circuit app. Hmm. Okay. So now, uh, seems like they are taking the step of increasing Dota Plus, uh, on the mobile platform. Right. Increasing Dota Plus. Investing in Dota Plus on the mobile platform. Now, what's happening here okay so what's most important is that you must be a Dota Plus subscriber if you are not a Dota Plus subscriber you will not be able to access anything else on the app that's at least for now right so some of the uh, key features that um, is, uh, is on the app is custom news feed okay so this is where you get to see what's happening in the uh, DPC the pro Dota scene on on the scores um, match highlights who wins and so on not really much on the match side but, but more on the data side of, of the matches all right um predictions okay so predictions is that where you can use shards to actually predict whichever team that uh you uh you guess will be winning all right so this is the most interesting uh topic in my opinion for this feature now there is a possibility that you spend shards on predicting a certain team whether they win or not and at the end of the day they may not win and you will lose your shards now if you if they win so you get more shards than you actually wager for does this sound like a very familiar activity to you mm, yeah and considering the wide audience of dota i'm not sure if uh, this is in my opinion. I'm really not sure if this is something that uh, is the right move ethically um, Trying to encourage some sort of um, The G activity the, the gam uh, That activity so so I'm a little bit mm, on this. Yeah um, Well next up uh, the next one is actually quite a fun uh feature of the app which is the fantasy app this is where you get to choose um, players uh, for certain tournament and see whether they if they perform well they get more points just like how any football fantasy any basketball fantasy any baseball fantasy app works they get more points and you get ranked higher and at the end of the day you get more shots so yeah shots is an interesting currency and actually um, it's really been a little bit disappointing on how shards are used but then again yep they're trying but yep we'll see how this goes getting more shards um yeah we'll have another discussion about that coming back to the features uh the app of the app um next is uh tournament details so here you can of course check out the uh, dpc tournaments what's happening around even past tournaments are are available so if you want to see what happened during the Kuala Lumpur major especially okay you can check it out there uh, as a summary of uh, information and uh, match details okay so match details uh, this is uh, of course details regarding the matches that have been played um, how many kills who won items that they bought and so on now if I make a comparison to because I use other apps as well similar apps uh, that actually shows me uh, the current happenings of uh, what happens in the uh, Dora scene um, most of it in the DPC uh, sometimes there is either delay in the data or there is um, or the data just doesn't show so this being a official app from Valve um, it'll be interesting to see how up to date the data is and how accurate it is and how much information can they give? Can they offer more information as compared to the uh, plenty of apps out there that has already done this right now without needing Dota Plus? Hear me, Val. Without needing Dota Plus, right? And people can use it for free there. And you can still kind of play your own sort of in-app in predictions there as well. So, Dota Plus... Can you please do better? I know you just started. This is an opportunity. Let's see surprises um, with what you can do. Now, um, that's the that's basically a summary of it. Basically, am I really excited about this app? I'm not too sure at this point. 
it does give me a little bit of feeling that I'll get bored over the app uh, after a while so we'll see how it goes yeah cuz yeah we'll just see how it goes well let me know in the comments below what are your favorite apps um, what do you like about them I like to hear and if there are any interesting apps that are uh, somewhat similar to this um, do do leave it in the comments below I like to check it out and maybe I'll do a review about it if it's interesting for you guys and Yes, yeah, so that's it for today. Uh, this is on the Dota Pro Circuit app. If you like this kind of content and you like what I talk about, um, and I'd like to talk about it a bit more, of course. And if you like what you hear, um, do like, subscribe, and share it because next month onwards, which is April 2019, we are going to start a monthly giveaway. So if you don't want to miss out on that, like, subscribe, ring the bell, get notified, and... We'll see you in the next episode.